Good morning, happy Thursday. Uh, we are expecting a cooler front um, this afternoon in Arkansas and I cannot be more excited. As you can tell, I have my pumpkin shirt on. I am bringing in the fall vibes. I am bound and determined that we are gonna get some fall weather, guys. It is gonna happen here in Arkansas. If you've already gotten fall weather, well, I don't like you. No, I'm just kidding. Enjoy the fall weather if you've already got it, but fingers crossed, toes crossed, like everything crossed that I we are supposed to get some fall weather this weekend and early next week in Arkansas, and I am ready. Oh my gosh, 95 degrees, record highs yesterday in Arkansas. I'm done, done with summer, I'm over it. Um, sorry about that, I just always like to talk about the weather, especially when it's fall vibes. I've got the fall vibe going on, which is awesome. Hope you guys are having a fantastic week. My name is Amy Smith Hightower. We are going to, I'm a ketogenic meal planner and mentor from Batesville, Arkansas who's lost over 100 pounds following the ketogenic diet, and guess what? We have created a totally free keto community, totally free, of 170,000 people who have lost over 2 million pounds combined. So, what I wanted to address with you guys today, number one, is share this video out with everyone that you know. Share it in keto groups, share it in meal plan groups, weight loss groups, whatever group you're in that you think this could help someone. The my sister will go through here and you need to write shared and how many groups you shared it in in the comments below. And my sister goes through and picks three winners. Every single, every single Friday, I think she does it, um, to mail out You Can Keto prize packs, which are pretty cool. So thank you guys so much for hopping on. What we're going to address today is some of the questions that I get asked about the most in my inbox. Um, so many times people reach out to me and say, look, Amy, oops, sorry, the husband called. He should know better than that. Um, every, like, I get asked every single day. Look, Amy, I started this. There's 10 of us in my office, and we all started it together, and everyone's losing weight but me. Okay, I get asked that. I also get, I also get messages that say, I'm the only one in my household doing keto. I can't stick with it. I get messages every single day that say, I'm 10 pounds for my goal weight, and I can't lose anymore. I'm going to answer all of those questions today, Okay. We're going to talk about why some people lose faster than others on keto. I'm going to talk about what you can do if you're a slower loser like me. Slower loser like me. Guys, it took me well over a year to lose 100 pounds. People look at me now and they're like, oh my goodness, look at her. She's talking about, you know, look at how fast she lost weight. Guys, it took me over a year. Um... You can go to my personal page, click follow and see first because I am maxed out on my friends list. And you can go back to my featured photos and see my before and afters, my personal before and afters. Go back and read some of my journey and story. You guys will see it's not all been good days. I didn't lose weight every single day. And that's the first thing we're going to address today is number one, let's get our expectations back to reality. Okay. Just because you flip through Facebook and you see someone that's lost 100 pounds in five months, most likely that's spam. But let's get our reality in, like, let's, let's make some realistic goals, okay? It's not all about weight loss. The ketogenic diet was actually formed in 1920s as a medical treatment for children with seizure disorders. Guys, when you are eliminating sugar, processed foods, things like that from your diet, you are helping your body to become healthier. So let's get the focus off these unrealistic weight loss goals, okay? Um, number two, people lose at different rates. There's not a thing in the world you can do about it, okay? If you have more to lose, you're probably going to lose faster. If you're drinking, before you start keto, if you're drinking a 12-pack of Dr. Pepper a day, guilty, hashtag guilty right here, 
Um, if you're drinking 12 Dr. Pepper a day and then you quit soda, so, soda, soda, and if you quit Dr. Pepper cold turkey, guess what's going to happen, guys? you're probably gonna lose weight faster. Because guess what? You gave up Dr. Pepper. That, those are things that happen, but you may lose that initial water weight and those additional, that first yuck detox. You may lose that quick. And then after that, it may take you longer to lose the weight. That is okay. That is 100% okay. If you think for one second I have not picked up that scale in my bathroom and thrown it up against a wall, you're crazy. Because guess what I have? There have been days I didn't lose when I was trying to lose. I, you, I've done the egg fast. It doesn't work. Don't do it. Okay? We have a three-day keto kickstart that Catherine is personally doing an event for and push for your better. Not to believe it starts on Monday. Guys. Do the three-day keto kickstart. That is the healthiest way I know to get you losing again, to break a stall. And if you want to do it as a group, make sure you're in Push For Your Better. Write group in the comments below if you're not currently in our group. And we will get you added so you can do that with us. Guys, quit comparing yourself to other people. Everyone's journey is different. Do you? And when people tell me keto just doesn't work for me, my solution to that is, okay, guys, your body's not on Amazon Prime. It's not going to deliver everything in two days. You didn't become unhealthy in two days. You're not going to become healthy in two days. It's just not how it works. I'm sorry. I wish there was. There's no magical pill, potion, or shake that's going to make you healthy in two days. And if somebody tries to tell you there is, they're just trying to sell you something. I mean, that's just all there is to it. Um, you have to get your mindset around the fact that maybe the days that you're not losing weight, what's happening is your gut's healing. Your body is needing what you take in to heal it from the inside out. The more damage you have done to the inside of your body, the longer it can take to heal. So on those weeks that the scale's not moving, remember that your body is healing on the inside. You are feeding your body what it needs to be the healthiest version of you. Say that every single morning when you get up. Say it again before you go to bed. Let me give that to you one more time. You are feeding your body what it needs to be the healthiest version of you. If you guys need help, make sure you're in Push For Your Better. Make sure you tune into our announcement post. Shoot me a message. Do whatever you need to do, but don't give up. We have a keto community of 170,000 people who are here to support you. So please, please don't give up. We believe in you. I believe in you. And I know you can do it. Stick it out. It's totally worth it. I'm in a whole different place in my life thanks to keto. No matter what life throws at me, I know I'm living the best version of me and being the healthiest version of myself. Please write group in the comments below and I'll catch you on the inside. And we'll see you next week.